Hey, this is Jamie at Useful Knowledge. Well, I'm out here in my barn, and we are about to answer a big question for all you people with propane barbecue grills, black stones, even Coleman stoves that you have adapted to run off a 20-pound propane tank. We're going to answer the question, if you refill your propane tank, do you get more propane for less money than if you just exchanged your propane tank? So what we have here is two 20 pound propane tanks practically identical the one on the left I had refilled the one on the right I exchanged so let's weigh them up and let's answer the question okay I've zoomed in so you can see our digital readout on our scale so first I'm going to weigh the exchanged propane tank okay that leveled out to 33 pounds, 11.6 ounces. All right, next we are going to weigh the refill propane tank. Okay, that is 36 pounds, 2.2 ounces. So obviously there's more propane in this tank. But here's the question, how much more? So there's some more calculating we have to do. Okay, to understand exactly how much propane we have in each one of these tanks, we need to know the tear weight of each tank. The tear weight is basically the tank when it's empty. So this is the refill tank, so its tear weight is 17.1 pounds. Okay, the tear weight on the exchange tank is 18 pounds, as you can see right there. Okay, stay tuned for some calculations and understanding how much we have in each one of these tanks okay now for the comparison chart so heads up here we took everything that we just weighed that was in ounces and we moved that over into a decimal representation just to make sure our calculations go smoothly okay so first let's go through the exchange tank which is on the left hand side it had a total weight of 33.725 it had a tear weight of 18 pounds so that gave us 15.725 pounds of propane. That calculated out to 3.826 gallons for a total cost of $21.98. That gives us a cost per pound of $1.40 and a cost per gallon of $5.75. Now let's go to the right-hand side for the refill tank. It weighed out at 36.138 pounds. We had a tear weight of 17.1. That gives us 19.038 pounds of propane. And that's 4.632 gallons, a total cost of $16.63. So that calculates out to a cost per pound of 87 cents with a cost per gallon of $3.58. Okay, folks are going to ask, why did the refill tank not end up with 20 pounds of propane in it? Well, actually, they are required to leave some expansion room in those tanks when they refill them. So you have about a one pound's worth volume in that that just has to be left open for expansion. Okay, by looking at this chart, it is obvious that if you go the refill route, you're going to get more propane in your tank and it's going to cost you less per gallon. All right, so if you've got a few minutes, take your tank to a location that actually refills the tank. In my area, it's mostly farmers co-ops and farm supply stores. Okay, if you're in a hurry and you want something convenient, the exchange route is the way to go for you. And we here at Useful Knowledge are not knocking the exchange route. It's a convenience and you know you just pay more for something that's convenient. That's just the way it goes. So we hope you gain some useful knowledge on the differences between an exchange propane tank or a refill propane tank. Thanks for watching.